This r askredit user asks students of Reddit, what is your favorite Zoom story so far? Was sitting in class with my usual background up and got hungry. So I decided to grab a snack out of the cabinet next to me. Come back to my teacher asking in chat, did I just see encyclopedia pull cookies out of a tree? Quote, I mean, if it was a wood cabinet, then technically. Every day in class one put a random background on. One day was an optical illusion. One day a wall of toilet paper. One day that this is fine meme. One day a sped up version of a round of plague ink. Dot. I think I got bonus points on one of my chemistry tests for using a periodic table as my background. On the day of one of my tests. Proctored through Zoom. I had a background on which took the old DVD screensaver. But instead of the logo reading DVD it said COVID. My teacher asked if I could turn it off. As it was distracting for her. I said of course. But I don't know if that'll be much better. I was in my mom's art room. So the background was bright and colorful and significantly more distracting than a slowly moving purple box on a black background. I took about 30 seconds in paint to make a solid black background. Which she greatly appreciated. One kid shaved off his hair and eyebrows on live a couple days before class so when I saw him I was take off your hat and then the whole class told him to take it off and told the teacher what he did so she was like oh I want to see it so eventually he did and then we spent the next 30 minutes comparing him to Steve Harvey and Lil Bill in the chat. Good times. We had a kahoot and over half the participants got the first question wrong and this one kid that everyone makes fun of was like am I in last place? I'm in 40th place. And then one of the seniors goes. Probably. Is anyone lower than 40th? I was in 41st but didn't want to say anything and the poor kid got bashed by like 10 different people and I feel kinda bad. Kid brought it on himself for asking. Don't feel bad it's just self-preservation. Survival of the fittest. Something I witnessed online. We were bored out of our minds when this dude starts moaning and making random weird anime noises. He thought he was muted until the teacher starts to say. I know you are very excited but please mute your mic. Quote. Dude quit the meeting. Random weird anime noises. Please do not describe any further. That is enough. First day of Zoom classes a kid fell asleep with his camera still on. Also one of my professors accidentally kicked herself out of the meeting for 5 minutes. The teacher had bad internet at the time so he got disconnected. Some random guy got assigned as admin and unmuted us all. Eventually we all decided just to play a general trivia kahoot with the new host screen sharing. To this day it remains the most exciting thing to happen in year 10 science. On April the 1st I recorded myself pretending not to hear anyone. Then put the video as a virtual background. Then. Went under the table. So that I wouldn't be seen in front of the virtual background. And started a meeting. People were giving me advice on how to turn on the microphone. When I literally jumped out of myself. LOL. You should have seen their faced XD. So the video was the virtual background? XD. A relatively new feature of Zoom. We use Teams. My class asked whose doors making that noise. I turn around to look at my birds who are screaming behind me like normal. And one is somehow inside of one of the food bowls. They have covers over so only a small hole for them to stick heads in. Another one is trying to rip another bowl out of the side. And the other two are taking in turns sitting on top of each other's heads. The class quickly point to me as the culprit for the loud door. I got muted. I'm not a student but I work for a school district and we had a ton of phone meetings with various people. Every time we heard barking in the background. My boss would try to guess whose dog it was. She was surprisingly accurate. A lot people in town have dogs. And apparently my boss has met and played with enough of them to recognize their voices over the phone. Every once in a while someone in my class will say, 
do I hear birds? And all realize that mine have been screaming for at least 15 minutes. It's crazy how quickly you learn to tune them out. Strangely your neighbors lack that ability. A work call story. One of my co-owners decided to get on with some housework in the background of the call. So left a clock with shorts on in front of the camera and pretended it was himself. He then added a banana and two BS. We don't get much work done. Some kid printed a black piece of paper with the words reconnecting facing the computer lens to avoid a Zoom class. The only reason he was caught was because the paper had reconnecting. Sick. What does sick mean? It indicates that the word phrase is being repeated exactly as it was originally written. Any spelling or grammatical errors were not corrected. It means it was spelled that way originally. Which shows that the person quoting it was recreating the original error. And not making it themselves. Adverb. Used in brackets after a copied or quoted word that appears odd or erroneous to show that the word is quoted exactly as it stands in the original. As in a story must hold a child's interest and enrich his. Sick. Life. Quote dot. That example kind of sucks. Someone kicked the teacher in the middle of them lecturing us. Someone's got BS. Depends on where he was kicked. Out of the meeting or actually FG knocked them out? In my class, we have our videos turned on but our audio remains muted except for the professor. Professor decided to unmute a classmate and get him to read the slide only for us to hear him getting yelled at by his parents. That dude just kept reading the slide while his parents yelled at him. Our professor didn't know what to do and just acted like everything was normal. He didn't unmute anyone for the rest of the class though. Edit. Not my favorite Zoom story but definitely the most memorable. That's kind of sad. What is she going to do? Sir. Please don't yell directly at my students during class. Please. It's distracting. Quote. There is a reason we take kids out of their home to teach them and it has nothing to do with the kids. For sure. He even smiled halfway through and I don't know if that was to acknowledge the yelling or to assure us that he was fine. Our teacher was screen sharing and I randomly discovered a pen button. So I clicked on it and turns out you can draw on the shared screen. I just started putting some dots there. Thinking, oh, this is cool. Quote dot. Then the teacher said, I don't know who's doing it, but stop drawing on my scan. I kinda freaked out and deleted it. It didn't occur to me that everyone could see it XD. Just start drawing over the teacher's face. Should combine your idea. Just start drawing over the teacher's face. With. You. The Jack 38. S idea. You should have drawn a DK. I remember two kids started playing tic-tac-toe when that happened in our physics class. Some students seem to think they don't need to wear trousers. And they also don't seem to know how a webcam works. The combination isn't pretty. I had a coworker adjust the camera to show me something in their home. Got a quick shot of their undies. I think they realized it half a second after I did. So I looked away like I didn't see it and will never mention it. Wear pants people. I just can't imagine ever feeling so comfortable to not be wearing some sort of pants while on a call. They might be pajamas but ill at least always have pants on. My professor's PC crashed so while she was restarting someone started screen sharing a modern warfare match. One of my classes most of us got along real well and the teacher was chill. Plus it was in the evening so a lot of us always got there early to chill because we had time before the class when it was in person. So we ended up just hanging out for like 30 minutes before class every day just streaming video games and hanging out. Which was real nice since most of our social interaction was suddenly drastically decreased by the quarantine. Female student forgot to turn mic off and began having SX during Zoom school meeting. It happened in Colombia. Link. What's the teacher saying throughout this? She tries her best to continue the class regardless. But eventually she goes, Lorena. We can hear you. 
not Zoom but WebEx. I defended my PhD thesis this spring. During the open questions, the dean of our school started to ask a question. But something was off with his mic and he sounded like a chipmunk 100% chipmunk. I was still so scared I barely noticed and he typed his question instead. But after the fact everyone tells me it was absolutely gold. I attended a defense of a master's thesis via Zoom. The supervisor of the student emphasized several times that everyone must be muted during the presentation. Halfway through the mother of the student starts speaking to whomever she was sitting with for everyone to hear. And the student groans, boom. In the best upset teenager fashion I ever heard. I had to explain what Discord was to my parents. My dad said once that I shouldn't get Discord because its name sounded like a hacking tool. Uh oh big boomers. Kinda. It was really out of character for him. I use Teams. And my favorite call is when I accidentally announced to my whole class one was going to go toilet. My mic was on and I didn't know it. It was super embarrassing but now it's really funny because my reaction was super awkward. If you've the nerve, you could make it a running joke and make it your sign off. Teacher. Okay class. See you all next time. Quote. Other students. Bye. See ya. Uh. Etc. You. Don't know about you all. But I need the toilet. Bye. Quote. Guess same thing happened to my friend. I got a lecture from a person that was laying in their bed while giving it. He is a university professor. I'd respect that. I mean, not like I'm not watching in bed. At the end of every single class my calculus teacher shows us his cats while Nian Cat plays at the background. My calculus teacher was the best teacher I ever had. He was very honest about having failed calculus when he took it the first time in high school so he made sure to teach it the way he wish he'd been taught. Many in my class don't like him. BC they think he's slow. But he just takes his time and makes sure everyone is understanding. He sounds like a good teacher. I live in Lithuania so most of my teachers don't speak English. Teacher what does leave meeting mean? Students. In Lithuanian, it means leave meeting. Teachers leaves the meeting. He had enough of your class. Also, I've been to Lithuania last summer. It's a beautiful country. By the way, why do you have so many storks? There are enormous amounts of them everywhere. It was a she. And I found why Lithuania has so many storks. But I translated it to English by Google Translate. Storks are our close neighbors. It is believed that in Lithuania they have been close to humans for at least 1,000 years. Professor Tadas Ivanauskas wrote visually about such a neighborhood. Quote dot, where a person takes care of him. He pays off with trust. Here there is a contract between a human and a stork. And the sign of this contract is an old wheel of carriage or a harrow loaded into a tree or on the roof. So, when our bird sees that sign. It really knows that nothing bad will happen to it here. And when it lands in the nest. It calmly looks at the people crashing under it. Quote. Wow. This is really interesting. Thank you. Have a nice day. A guy. Who woke up like five minutes earlier. Didn't notice. I hope. That his camera was on. He got dressed in front of 100 plus people. And this is why if I don't specifically plan to use my camera. I disable it in device manager. One of my favorite features on my laptop is the physical sliding shutter on the camera. I have a piece of paper taped over mine. Most days unless I have a scheduled video meeting I'm sitting at my laptop in just my underpants. I was in basic French class and there's a short paragraph with a character named Vladimir. The French teacher asked who is Vladimir. In the story. The one Russian girl in class said, a bad president. Let me guess she fell out of her window a few days later. She killed herself with two shots to the back of the head. One of my older teachers didn't know what memes were, has no idea what she's doing in a Zoom call. A couple of weeks before we were supposed to go back to classes. 
the vice principal sent a message to all the teachers to screenshot their calls for the newsletter to show how we were coping as a school. Quote, fast forward to when we're back. And my teacher had screenshotted our whole class with shitty meme green screens in the middle of the call. And one of my friends is the center image for the newsletter with the communist flag flying proudly behind her. This is just lovely. I would have chosen the couch. Thanks for watching. Make sure to like and subscribe to the channel for more videos.